Hi, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jo. If you're new here, welcome and please consider subscribing. Leave a like as well if you found the video useful. Today I'm going to show you how I sew buttonholes using my Singer Domestic Machine. First, position your needle in the middle. Take off your all-purpose sewing foot and attach the buttonhole foot. Measure the diameter of your button and add 1 8 of an inch to that measurement. Mark your buttonhole length on your fabric. Place the fabric under the foot so that the markings on the buttonhole foot aligns with the starting marking on the fabric. Lower the foot so that the buttonhole center line marked on the fabric aligns with the center of the buttonhole foot. Adjust the stitch line tile to the image of the buttonhole to set the stitch density. Then set the stitch width at 6. The width however may need to be adjusted according to the project. So a test for us to determine this. Follow the four step sequence changing from one step to another with the pattern selector dial. When moving from step to step through the buttonhole process, be sure that the needle is raised before turning the pattern selector dial to the next step. Take care not to sew too many stitches in step 1 and 3. After you've completed your sewing, use a seam ripper and cut the buttonhole open from both, both ends towards the middle. Tips Slightly reduce the upper thread tension will produce better results. Use a stabilizer for fine or stretchy fabrics. Thank you for watching my video. I hope this was useful to you and has propelled you one step forward in your sewing journey. I hope you stick around in my channel and maybe you'll find something else that is useful. You can also check out my previous video on how to sew a button. See you in the next one.